inappropriate and egregious. That's how some are describing comments a, a ferry captain made while at a court hearing for his son. Thanks for joining Fox 13 News at 5. I'm Frankie Thompson. Fox 13's Shira Matsuzawa listened to the audio and spoke to the San Juan County Sheriff about his own outrage when he heard those comments. My name is Albert Brandt. I'm a captain of the Inner Island Ferry here at, at Friday Harbor. This is audio from Washington State Ferry Captain Albert Brandt. Last month, he was given the opportunity to address the court regarding conditions of his son's release. His son appeared in court on multiple charges related to child pornography. During that hearing, Captain Brandt said having his son in a jail that's not in the county where he lives would create a hardship for him. If he's if he's going to be in Highland County or Skagit County, you understand what a ferry ride takes to get over there and back. And it would take me out of a day of work. If I'm not working, the ferry's not running here, okay? And it was that comment that San Juan County Sheriff Eric Peter called inappropriate. It came across as a veiled threat of, well, your inner island transportation isn't going to run. I was just stunned and outraged. He says he was even more shocked because Captain Brandt was in court dressed in his Washington State Ferries uniform. If one of our employees showed up in uniform and represented themselves as being from our agency and then made egregious comments like that, that would be dealt with swiftly. Sheriff Peter reached out to Washington State Ferries after hearing that audio. Uh, they apologized and said that they were uh, starting an investigation. He says this is not a shot at WashDOT or the ferries, but rather Captain Brandt. And this is now giving all of the good people at those agencies a bad rap. It's just not right to go make comments like this and have our community worried that our inner island boat is not going to run effectively. Fox 13 reached out to Washington State Ferries. They sent us this statement, which said, Washington State Ferries is conducting a formal investigation into the matter. Please be assured that WSF is taking the matter seriously. And all we want is for our community members to be able to move around without fear of our service possibly being disrupted of what appears to be a, a vendetta or a veiled threat by one individual. Shira Matsuzawa, Fox 13 News. At that hearing, the judge reduced the captain's son's bail from $500,000 to $250,000. The sheriff says he was taken to Skagit County Jail and later bonded out. Fox 13 also reached out to the captain. He declined to comment.